The theme for the year here is about how technology is changing society. Like I broke it down to this endless pursuit, you know, by humans. This endless striving for growth and more, you know, more money, more things. That itself then led to, you know, linked into a whole range of interesting visualization techniques based on endlessness or, you know, yearning for the infinite. Motion, yeah, because we've already seen the scale of stuff. Yeah. I was just trying to figure out ways of linking the videos together at the end to reference back to your earlier right. bits, you know? Okay. I've been working on this for like a year and a half. The first couple of months of the project is me reading and thinking about, you know, what I can visualize and what I can show. And then I write all the ideas up and then I start sending them to, to the visual artists to, you know, talk about what they, how they can visualize them. And, and then I start writing the music for each chapter. So the music is a score to all the visual chapters. So like Penrose tiling, you can tile an infinite plane without it repeating. It's this big, uh, beautiful structure. So I, I thought, okay, how can I do that musically? So I set up lots of loop lengths where each loop length was a prime number. It basically means that no two bars are the same. If it played for two months, you know, you'd get a bar that was the same as one of the bars that happened two months ago. And obviously there's things like, you know, I can, you know, say, okay, the loop lengths have to be like this or the structure has to be like this. But fundamentally it's about expressing feeling. The great thing about music is that you can communicate feelings that you can't put into words. And actually I would really struggle to put things into words. The basic way of putting it was just through, I wanted to make something really engulfing and yeah, mad. structures and, and a lot of detailing and just it's just a really beautiful structure itself plus the wood is light enough to project onto we just decided to use the space as much as we could and turn the, the, the whole the beautiful hall into a canvas constrained to endlessly follow the laws of the laws of nature. You know, we like to think we're something more than that, but we're not. It's a commentary on that system that we're stuck in, which can be a beautiful thing or it can be a horrible thing. <laughs> <laughs>